Welcome back guys to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan, and tonight I want to talk about and remember the movie Signs. A lot of you probably remember this movie from M. Night Shyamalan. It was a very popular movie of his. It's probably my all-time favorite M. Night Shyamalan movie other than The Village. And, you know, this movie came out when I was eight years old, back in 2002. So, and it, it scared the absolute crap out of me. <laughs> Especially this scene right here. The startling footage we're about to show you was photographed by a 42-year-old, Romero Valadares. This video was taken yesterday afternoon at his son's seventh birthday in the city of Paso Fundo, Brazil. It was sent to the local news bureau there and sent to us via satellite just a few minutes ago. All initial opinions are this is genuine. What you're about to see may disturb you. That scene was horrifying. When I saw it as a kid, I think that I got so afraid. I remember I went home and actually had nightmares from that scene. So I remember this movie so clearly as it was day. If you guys have never seen this movie, it's about a family who lives out on a farm um, surrounded by cornfields. And basically they they wake up one morning and their whole crops have been turned into a sign. And spoilers, the movie is about aliens, um, you know, so the movie's been out for a long time now, about almost over 20 years. So it's been a long time. And I remember seeing it in theaters when I was a kid with my parents. And I remember my dad wanted to go watch it so bad, but I kind of wanted to talk about the movie a little bit because it's definitely one of my favorite movies. And it's kind of a cool movie to bring up again and to kind of reminisce about the movie and just kind of talk about some funny scenes in it. I remember one of my all-time favorite scenes in the movie is when uh, Mel Gibson and um, uh, Joaquin Phoenix, thank you, I can't even think about right, I can't even think right now. <laughs> I'm a little tired tonight, and I'm actually without glasses tonight, if you guys didn't notice. And when they're running around the house and they're cussing out the alien that's on top of the roof, because if you remember Bo, the little girl, she comes to Mel Gibson, who's sleeping in his bed, and um he she's like can i get another glass of water and that's like a big thing and that's actually an easter egg for the movie right because the aliens spoilers they're afraid of water which at the end of the movie but she comes and she asks her dad for a glass of water and and he's like can i have another glass of water and then he looks up and he sees like the alien on top of the roof standing up there and uh <laughs> they start to get uh really afraid because they're like this dude is like how the heck is he on top of the roof they think it's one of those um i don't remember what the uh, what the exact uh names of the guys but they like blamed a certain like um somebody like in his group or whatever it was like a bunch of boys that caused trouble in the town and it was just a really funny scene and i remember they come back in the house and he's like i swore you know because the guy in the movie he's like a retired um he was a uh, a father like in the catholic church or a priest or whatever and so um he was like i swore and he's like i heard <laughs> and so just moments like that but you know you have very intense moments um also really sad moments not other than the alien scene but you have that scene when they're all sitting around the table for dinner and they're talking about what they want for dinner right and they make everybody makes a dinner because they think it's going to be their last meal and they don't want to leave the home because you know they just want to stay at home and but I remember them sitting around and they start to cry because they think they're all gonna die, you know, like this is it. 
and I remember they asked like, oh, we should pray. We should say a prayer to God or whatever. And they're like, no, we don't want to. And then they start crying. And so th that was a really emotional scene. Another one was the the one where a really scary scene too is when Mel Gibson goes to that house of the friend of his, which is actually M. Night Shyamalan, the director. Um, and he goes to the house and he, he locked one of the aliens in the closet, I remember. And uh, he's reaching under the door, right? And like the alien, like the claw comes out and tries to grab him. Oh man, he like cuts the alien's fingers off. Uh, yeah, that, it's just like some of those scenes in that movie were pretty intense. And being an eight year old watching that movie, like it's pretty scary. <laughs> I mean, I was just a kid. Uh, and then another scene I remember a lot that always sticks in my mind was when they're down in the basement and they're all locked down in the basement. And uh, the kid, he's like backed up against an old mine shaft, right? He's like, and then all of a sudden you see like a hand that's like right on his shoulder. And uh, he goes into, um, cause I deal, he deals with asthma, right? So he carries around um, an inhaler in the movie, the boy, uh, who's actually speaking about Scream fans, by the way, that's actually young um, Culkin, right? <laughs> um, who played Charlie in Scream 4, so that's cool. But yeah, he, the alien gets on his hand and he just starts to freak out. He starts inhaling and the dad's like holding him on the ground. Like, come on, breathe, breathe. You know, that's a sad and intense moment. And, you know, you think the boy's going to die or make it through the night. Like you can do this. And he's having like an asthma attack. So yeah, I, I just wanted to kind of talk about this movie for a moment because it was, it was, it's such a classic moment, uh, movie that it, it kind of gets overlooked really a lot of times and you know if you haven't watched this movie i definitely recommend that you go check it out it's a really good alien invasion movie if you guys like alien movies this is one it's it's a classic i think and it was like perfect for my time and i remember it just so so like just it was yesterday and i think i'm actually gonna watch it again this week because it's just such a good movie um but yeah let me know what you guys think about in the comments below. Have you guys seen the movie signs? Do you enjoy the movie signs? Uh, I know this was kind of a random video, but I wanted to uh, talk about the movie because uh, it's just so much fun. I don't know. I just think it's a fun movie. It's just, it's a scary movie. It can be right. It can be intense. It has funny moments. Um, so yeah, but anyways, I just kind of wanted to remember the movie signs. Um, and speaking of signs, thank you guys for the 400 subscribers you guys are awesome we've hit over 200 subscribers just in like three weeks like that's insane we've been growing so much just in three weeks and we really appreciate your guys love and support and just the views for the channel and watching our videos and liking the videos and commenting and giving us your scream theories and talking about the video games and just everything you know we, we really appreciate you guys so much and we can't me and Caleb can't be more humbled by the way you guys have been treating us and uh, you guys are awesome. And so we just really want to say thank you. We know it's a small milestone of hitting 400, but you got to start somewhere, right? You got to keep growing. You got to keep pushing, keep grinding. And uh, yeah, also I'm going to mention it again because we're still a week out from, you know, from Saturday, this Saturday, we're going to be giving away two free movie tickets for scream six. So if you guys haven't entered that giveaway, there's a video go check it out um, i'll put it in the link in the comment section below if you haven't yet go put a comment in that video hashtag scream six and uh, that video will also have all the details of the giveaway so that's going to be happening on saturday but anyways guys we just want to thank you for the support thank you for watching this video and remembering the movie signs with me and uh, yeah i'll see you guys on the next video take care